Hi there Power Ranger fans, it's time for another Power Rangers Ninja Steel toy review with me, Admin Gold King Ranger from the Gold King Ranger team. In this video, we will be reviewing the Power Rangers Ninja Steel Ninja Blaster. Cool. So, the Ninja Blaster toy is part of the roleplay toy range, along with the, such toys as the Deluxe Ninja Battle Morpher and the Ninja Starblade. And this in the series, the Ninja, the Ninja Blaster is the Ranger's sidearm melee shooty weapon, <laughs> whatever you want to call it. <laughs> I'm doing, oh this is a great start to review. <laughs> oh dear. Oh, I killed me. Okay, now, so what we have here is the blaster itself in all its fiery frogginess glory and you have three ninja power stars. We have the red ninja power star, the Kodiak zord star, or white zord star, whatever you want to call it, and the, now this is quite new, an element star, fire mode. Cool. So what we're going to do first is we're going to take a look at these Ninja Power Stars in our trusty Ninja Battle Morpher. So I'm just going to turn it on, make sure it's not on try me mode because I've done that before in a review and it wasn't good. So make sure that's right. Yes. Now let's start with this one, which is your typical Ninja Ninja Steel Red Star. Awesome. Right. Ooh, I don't careful. The stars oh the stars can be a little tricky to remove, as I said in previous reviews, but just be careful when you take them. In fact, best I think the best way to get them off is to try and grip them from this part. Because if you try and grip them from this sort of area, you could probably tear this off. Right, the next sword is the white Kodiak Zord Star. So that said Kodiak Zord Summon, and when you press it again... It makes no difference. <laughs> so no matter, what's, um, no matter what Ninja Power Star you put in there, it does the exact same thing. There we go. Right, one more now, and that's the Element Star Fire Mode. That's pretty cool. Okay. Oh, I don't. Before this thing starts spinning out of control. <laughs> okay. Right, that's it for the Morpher. Right, now let's have a look at the Ninja Blaster itself. So, the Ninja Blaster, as you can see, is a nice blue with a nice flaming sticker. And it's got on the front, as you can tell, it's a frog design. Now, it does look a lot different from the one you see in the TV show. Uh, for example, this area. That in the show you'd usually be able to attach a Ninja Power Star here in the show but unfortunately Bandai decided to take that feature out. Why? I don't know. They could have easily just made it so you could put the Power Star there just so it looks a bit show accurate at least. Mind you, you've got blue tack, sticky tack. You could easily just stick one on there and then you could just pretend you're doing it. <laughs> Anyways, so this doesn't do any sounds but there is a reason why I picked this up and why I really like this and that I will show you now. What on earth is that for I hear you ask? Well, watch this. We're going to put the power stars in here. Close the lid. And what happens now? Well, if, you, if we pull this bit at the top and then pull the trigger it shoots the power stars and no matter what oh god now this happens sometimes so just be careful sometimes the power stars do tend to get a little stuck so let's try that again hopefully i won't shoot it don't worry i won't shoot it at the camera okay <laughs> oh god. it always happens one star perfect the other one's a total mess let me just adjust that quickly oh god i will get this to fire okay Hopefully that will work now. 
Yay! And ready and boo! Hoo -hoo! That was fun. Now that I love. Now this would be a really good thing if you have the Ninja Steel Red Ranger costume, which should be coming out soon, according to the Smiths and Toys R Us websites. If you want to find out anything about the Ninja Steel Red and Blue Ranger costumes, kids' costumes, by the way, then be sure to email us so that we can send you the link to the costume, either red or blue, and the different age. Then email us and we'll or send us a message on Facebook and then we'll send you a link. Now it might not be available yet, but on Toys R Us you do have a thing where I believe you put your email in and it tells you when they come into stock. So that'll be good. So would I recommend this? Um well it's a good toy for kids or big kids like me, if you like disc shooting things. That's just why I like this. And also, it's good if you want to pick it up for the White Zord Star and also for the Fire Element Star, which is another reason why I picked this up, because I really wanted an Element Star, which is cool. Um, yeah, so that's pretty much it. So thank you guys for watching this video. Remember to like, comment, share this video, and of course, we'll be reviewing a lot more Ninja Steel toys in the upcoming weeks. So keep watching and remember to subscribe. Bye-bye for now, Ranger fans. May the power protect you and have a fantastic day. Bye-bye for now. Oh, one more thing I forgot to mention. In the Ninjas, in the Deluxe Ninja Battle Morph review, I forgot to mention, if you press this button here, the blade mode comes out. Thanks again for watching and see you next time, Ranger fans.